Let's just do a quick overview of the entire dashboard. For more details, go to the Knowledge Base. FAQs are individual videos for each feature. So first, when you log into your dashboard, you'll see an all-time record of how many visits, total patrons, total redeemed, and total SMS you sent, including the cost and how much money you've made so far. The next snapshot is a comparison to yesterday and the week before. The customer visit history, you can mouse over and see your visits per day or a particular day. If you want to swipe over down here, you can see the all-time peaks, lows, and valleys. The registration sources, this could include the app, Facebook, uh, a manual keyword, uh, incoming SMS. Uh, there's plenty of ways to join our program. That's all captured here, even multiple tablets. Um, customer subscriptions, you can tell how many are accepting SMS, how many are blocking, and how many are our loyalty only. And then there's this nice little average time between visits that's always fun to look at. The Facebook tab lets your users interact with your loyalty program through your Facebook page. It tells them how many visits they have and what coupons they have uh, still yet to redeem. The Reports tab features an ROI report which tells you how many texts you've sent total, how much it costs you, how much you've made, your total redemption rate, as well as ROI percentage returns. The default report tells you not only how many visits you're getting a day, but how many coupons are issued and how many new visitors you have each day. The Campaigns tab is where all the magic happens. You can edit your first visit coupon here by clicking the Edit. You can also view a campaign, pause, or start it here. Your auto reminders and algorithms are here uh, with your redemption rates per campaign, which you can start or pause. Your frequency, threshold, and regular campaigns are all here. The stores tab lets you switch between stores if you're a multi-store owner. And the settings tab allows you to put in your credit card, uh, add a keyword for your store, and set average ticket value. Another nice feature is if your patrons haven't come in in 12 or 18 months, it will automatically remove them from the communications list. You can reset your password here. So that's a quick overview of your dashboard. If you have any questions or comments, please email us or chat us. Or if you need more information, look at the knowledge base, FAQs, or our other helpful instructional videos.